Beauty and the Beast star Kristen Kruk is more than just a pretty face in the showcase hit. She plays a hard-nosed cop who's good with a gun. Too bad she's not so handy with her feet. I am klutzy, um, but not too klutzy. I've only tripped a few times. <laughs> Kristen trips a lot, um, and it's funny. She's definitely a goof. She always does the like. That's Kristen dancing. When we recently visited the set, we got to see Kristen's lighthearted side for ourselves. The only problem was, it was supposed to be a serious scene. You think living in a cage isn't doing that? Well, it turns out I'm monstrous enough to even get out of it. No, <laughs> so it ends now. Some of the content is, you know, it's, it's, it's dark a lot of the time, so we try and crack each other up as much as we can. While Kristen may be a self-described klutz, Ryan says he had some accidents too. Since I've been on the show, I've had several injuries. I'm not usually like that, but um, I know maybe they're like a Beauty and the Beast curse or something. I've torn my, uh, my ankle, my arm. Uh, yeah, I've, I've had a lot of doctor uh, visits on set. Luckily, no medical attention was required when we stopped by, but Ryan's beastly character did get an injection treatment for an episode airing in December. It may be the only way I get the answers to stay out of this cage. Jay's handsome looks have been getting him a lot of attention since Beauty and the Beast premiered on Showcase last month, but his New Zealand family helps keep him grounded. They're like, so what are you up to today, Jay? Uh, I'm just shooting a show. I just got a show in America. Oh, that's good. When will you be home for Christmas? <laughs> And for much more, don't forget to tune into ET Canada weeknights on Global.